What's going on, my DT? Welcome back to the Hill of Strikes Back 100% walkthrough. It's part 14. Alright, right when you start, there's a shoe stop. And over here, three doors. Go to the one on the left first, get rid of the shoe stop. And we'll go to this door. Be careful because of the shoe stop. The practice run, he was right there, so. I thought he was stationed there. I guess not. Get rid of that shoe stop. We'll grab the treasure inside. Do same thing here. Grab the gold key. Now we get into this door. Nope, that's the silver door. Chuck Testa. You tease us so well. So now we're opening up this door. Get rid of the shoe stop. First secret's on this wall right here. Grab the crown and your second secrets are on the right. It has a chain gun inside. Go over here, kill these guards. Open up this door. Kill the guard, grab the treasure inside. And for us, the same thing over here. Yep. Kill that shoe stuff. Kill this shoe stuff as well. And now we're opening up these doors over here. Nothing inside here except the gym ones, bones, bones, bones. This takes us over there, inside this area. Third secret's on this wall right here. And these rooms have really nothing new of value. As you can see, except this one right here, it has a silver key. Now we go inside this secret, treasure, and your final secret right here on this wall, right in front of the chest. There's a barrel on the left, and there's a medikit on the right. Health is like sparingly used on this map, so yeah. Now we'll backtrack to the silver door. There we go. And we are done. That's everything. Yeah, less than three minutes. And I wasn't even speeding, you know? I was... I didn't even hold down the shift button at all. So yeah, this floor is well designed in my opinion. It does offer a lot of variety. Excuse me, I mean, you got the secrets that just have a little bit of treasure. One has a mini kit and the barrel inside, pointless. And one has the chain gun. And, uh, yeah. Um, and then you get the gold key at the beginning. And then you use it to go up with a silver door, you know, across the map, and you come back to exit. And let's see here. This floor is not really dangerous. It's a rather mediocre map, in my opinion. Because compared to what we faced before, like floor 7, 8, and 9, or even 6, the mutants, yeah, not really difficult. Um, it's mainly got the shoe style, but it's got a few guards in it, so yeah. But the shoe style four are definitely the main enemy of this map. The majority of them are shoe style. So move on to floor 15 in the next video. Till I step out to team. Peace out everyone.